Welcome back. Local artist and friend of the show, Justin Binding, has been painting throughout the show as he does, and it's time to get a final look at his piece of art over yeah. here. Yeah. Hey, Justin. Hi, hey. Justin. All right. Talk to us about this park scene. Yeah. It, uh, it got better. <laughs> it sure did. It looked beautiful oh, to start with. Yeah. So, cool. so this is winter in Ellenberger Park. Yeah. Love I it, man. painted this scene last year. Yeah. yeah. Round of applause. Well, I painted it in person last year. Oh, th thank you. I appreciate that. Justin, we always love when you come on here. I know we always say he's one of our first, he was a first guest yeah. on the show. Yeah. And your career is incredible. You're always uplifting other artists. And so we want to make sure people have a chance to see your oh, work. Well, thank you so much. Yeah. So that with the gallery, I have been doing quite a bit of promoting of other people this year, but I, I still paint. So that's great. Uh, yeah. My show is actually coming up in March. So okay. I'll paint somewhere in the neighborhood of 100 paintings between now and March 1st, Friday. Wow. So a little paintings. bit more than one a day. Oh my gosh. So. Busy. Yeah. Keeping yeah. up all outside. I mean, I know that's your thing, the, the plain air thing. Probably about half outside. Okay. Okay. So I'll do a lot of winter scenes uh, with the snow covered. I heard it was snowing in Columbus yesterday. Okay. So okay. Brown County might be yeah. covered still. Nice. Yeah. So hopefully it doesn't melt off before I have a chance to get down there. Where is your gallery if so, people are in town and want to check it out? Yep. So it's by appointment only, but I'm on uh, East 10th Street, 2620 East 10th Street, okay. and uh, I am there actually most days. I'm in and out, so always it, it when I'm in the high production mode, it becomes more wet painting storage. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. just throwing paintings in and running around and painting all over the city. I love it. Well, we got to have you back on before that big exhibit. Yep, yeah, I will. Up. I, yeah. As long as you guys have me back, I'd oh, love to come. Uh, welcome anytime, man. Paint, well, it's so. incredible. I mean, he came in with a blank canvas yeah. and then just did this casually yeah. in, <laughs> what, like 50 <laughs> minutes? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah. It's a lot of practice. It really is a skill to be able yeah. to paint that quickly. That's evident, well, man. Thank you well, so thank much, you. Justin. You're so talented. We have his website right there. Yeah, just Justinvining.com. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, man. Thank we you appreciate so you much. Guys so much. Well, well, we want to thank our sponsors, actually. Yeah, let's go today. Over here yeah it's that time. Yeah. Thank you to our sponsors who help us make this show possible Scandinavian Designs for our couch, Sundown Gardens for our Indie Dow backyard, which and is covered in snow. Rejoice Financial. That's right. And uh, yeah, and the rest of our guests today Chef Tenoria, Brandon Wright, Fun show. City Mom, Special Olympics Indiana, Justin Vining, Panoy Garden Cafe, some great food, yeah. and artist Eric Washington. Uh, let's play the pop quiz. Oh, it's that let's time. Do it. Pop culture questions, basically. Yeah. And, and we want you to play along with us. Play along, yeah. All right, here we go. Here we go. Let's hear the question first. Question number one. First question. Who is the villain in The Little Mermaid? Ah, dang it. Uh, Ursula. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Man, that was quick. That was quick. It's closer to me, too. Man, you... Okay. Yeah, All I right. just... Uh, throw just that Ursula. Out of the gate, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Next one, Eric. <laughs> what is Winnie the Pooh's favorite treat? Honey. Yes. He just, he just scoops it out. You say that often that you're going to Winnie the Pooh I something. use Winnie the Pooh as a verb. I like that. To Winnie the Pooh something out of it. That's just, how you know it's good. Uh, I played Winnie the Pooh in first grade on you stage. Did? Yeah. How did I not know this about you? I don't know. We should talk about it later. Uh, Eric, third question. Which historic American highway was featured in the Disney film Cars? I don't Cars? know. No, but Gus has, so I know you're going to know this. That's Route 66. Yes. I, I didn't know that. I love that movie. It is so good. Aww. Cars 2 is an abomination. Uh, Cars <laughs> 3 is fantastic. Really? Cars 1, though, classic. Caleb agrees. Do not waste your time on Cars 2. I don't... Not good. Okay. It's just bad. I guess right. I won't watch it. Lazy writing. All right, let's go to the next one. <laughs> what do you call it when a bowler makes three strikes in a row? Oh. Turkey. Is it yes. a turkey? Yeah. Were you going to say that? Yeah. Oh, oh. No, not fast enough. Do you... <laughs> A little, a little, yeah, okay. All right, let's go. Okay. What type of race is the Tour de France? Um, ah. It's a, like a like a cyclist or like yes, is that, that's that was correct. the lightest little I, ding. You're like a bicycle race. All right, uh, I'm I'm up by two. Let's lightest. go, Eric. Which artist saying got a long list of ex lovers? They'll tell you I'm in. Oh. Taylor Swift. Your yes. favorite. I know. She's great. Uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow on Indie Now. Have a wonderful day.